These birds are smart, and when we come up with solutions to prevent damage and economic loss, a lot of times they'll figure out what we're doing and figure out a way to get around it. My name is Katie Hansen Dorn, and I'm a wildlife biologist with the National Wildlife Research Center. The National Wildlife Research Center is a part of the U.S. Department of Agriculture Wildlife Services Program. Its Mississippi Field Station is tasked with solving human wildlife conflicts associated with fish eating bird impacts to commercial aquaculture and natural resources. As a wildlife biologist, I basically serve as a link between the research biologists and the technicians. Together, the wildlife biologists and technicians serve as support staff to get research studies done, completed, planned, figure out logistics. Basically, we are the people that get stuff done. Depending on the research study that we're working on, we will collect biological samples, we'll inspect the animals, make sure they're doing okay, making sure that their pens are clean, making sure that they are fed. Uh, when we're conducting research studies out in the field, we're often prepping a lot of our equipment, making sure we have all the supplies we need, planning logistics, making sure we have enough people to actually get the work done. Then when we deploy and go out in the field to collect our samples, a lot of times we're traveling to remote locations using specialized equipment, including boats and ATVs. Other times we're observing wildlife in the field, either causing damage or conducting surveys to document numbers of animals. My background is actually in animal science. I have a bachelor's and a master's degree in animal science, specifically in ruminant nutrition. And I've always been interested in animal research. And when I was looking for a job, I was actually recruited because of my animal care and research background. One of the exciting things about working at the Mississippi Field Station is our collaboration with other scientists in different fields and the team atmosphere. Many of the times, the challenges that we face, you can't do it alone. And because of that, there is a sense of camaraderie because we're all working on the same team to solve the problem. You kind of cheer each other on and nobody's going home until the job gets done, so we're all in it together. 